Today, I'm going to be talking about vitamin E, specifically five foods that are rich in vitamin E that you can eat and why you would want to eat them. All right, now first off, vitamin E is one of the 24 essential micronutrients that are needed for human survival. It's a fat-soluble vitamin that comes naturally in the forms of tocopherols and tocotrienols and is most well known for having a powerful antioxidant property. But it also benefits the body by being an enzyme co-activator and by playing a protective role in neurological function. One of the lesser known benefits of vitamin E is its ability to protect and slow down the oxidation of polyunsaturated fats, which is great since the oxidation of PUFAs is likely one of the main reasons why high intake of PUFAs lowers testosterone levels. So with that being known, you could actually supplement with some vitamin E if you know you're going to be having a meal, maybe you're eating out uh, with some layers like fried foods, or if you're eating a high amount of polyunsaturated fats in your diet and you want something that will help alleviate the negative effects of that, you can actually supplement with something like this, this uh, vitamin E. Now there are actually a lot of foods that are high in vitamin E and we're going to get to five of them right now. Now the first one is spinach. Spinach is one of the best dark leafy vegetables to consume as a man. There are a lot of benefits of doing so, mainly the large amount of vitamins and minerals that are present in spinach and its low calorie content and the high amount of natural nitrates which have been shown to naturally raise nitric oxide production and erection quality. And when it comes to vitamin E, spinach is considered a decent source. At about 100 grams, spinach contains 2 milligrams of vitamin E in the form of alpha-tocopherol, which accounts for about 13% of the recommended daily amount. Now, second on the list is, once again, egg yolks. So if you've been following this series of videos where we talk about foods that are good for men to eat, that are high in micronutrient content, you'll notice that egg yolks are basically in all the videos. And that's also the case for vitamin E, as the egg yolk has plenty of vitamin E in it, along with some fat and cholesterol to improve its absorption. Now, like in the case of spinach above, we don't recommend that you solely get your vitamin E from eggs, as that would mean you're eating a ton of eggs, but it's still a good nutritional powerhouse. So about 100 grams of raw egg yolks contain 3 milligrams of vitamin E, which is 20% of the recommended daily amount in the alpha tocopherol form. Now, third on the list is Brazil nuts, and a lot of nuts are actually high in vitamin E. Brazil nuts really pack a punch. Brazil nuts are awesome because they're also lower in polyunsaturated fats than most nuts. And they're also an excellent source of selenium, boron, and magnesium, which are great for testosterone. At about 100 grams, you get about 7.8 milligrams of vitamin E, which is almost half of the recommended daily amount. All right, number four on the list is avocados. Avocados are very, very nutrient-rich fatty fruit. It also has an ample amount of monounsaturated fatty acids, which have been found to increase testosterone levels in several studies. And avocados also contain a bitter glycoside by the name of oloropin, which was found to significantly increase testosterone levels in rodents. And when it comes to vitamin E, 100 grams of avocados contain 3.1 milligrams of vitamin E. So that's about 20% of the recommended daily amount. Now number five on the list, last but not least, is shrimp. Shrimp are an awesome source of protein, but they're also very high in certain crucial micronutrients. Shrimp are one of the richest natural sources of the amino acid glycine, which our modern diets have far too little of. And when buying shrimp, make sure you get wild shrimp, not farm. And the latter are loaded with heavy metals. So when it comes to vitamin E, wild-caught shrimp is a decent source of vitamin E with about 2.5 milligrams per 100 grams, which is about 16% of the recommended daily amount. So those are the five vitamin E-rich foods. Hopefully you learned something today. Hopefully you got some ideas for some good new foods that you can integrate into your diet for your hormonal health. Uh, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more like it, subscribe to our channel. And I'll see you on the next video.